Hello everyone, and welcome back to Final Fantasy VII. In the last session, we completed our acquisition of the Huge Materials. All four of them are in our possession. And uh, we went to chat with uh, Mr. Boogie Woogie, Boogie Wonderland, and uh, he wants us to take him back to the City of Ancients. So that is our next... Uh, that is our next main quest objective. However, however, I have been advised that now is a good time to start doing uh, side side bits and bobs. A wrap up of a whole bunch of things I've seen, like this place right here, and uh, that I haven't been I haven't been able to do or haven't got around to doing or whatever. I have been advised that now is the time to do a whole lot of that. And so, that is what we're going to do today. Now, the first step of that is that to get to places like, uh, like that high whatever, <laughs> that bit on the cliff that we just saw, we are going to need a better chocobo. And uh, the process of getting better chocobos I, I have heard about before. <laughs> it is, uh, I think I've mentioned it in the playthrough before. Because, uh, I, I have not been a huge fan of, uh, the Chocobo stuff. We had the Chocobo, we had the Chocobo thing where I had to catch one to get across the marsh. And that led to some irritation. And then we had the Chocobo racing in the Gold Saucer after the, uh, prison section. And that was a bit irritating. And so, I think I mentioned before that I'd heard there was stuff like the most powerful spell or material or whatever in the game was locked behind chocobo racing and breeding and stuff. I've, like, this is just stuff I've picked up over the years, is that uh, one of the Final Fantasies had something like that, and it turned out to be this one. And uh, so I didn't think I'd ever, didn't think I'd ever want to really do that. But I've turned out to, like, really love this game, <laughs> and so I was like, okay, you know what? You know what? Let's, let's do that. So, uh, if we go into here, you will see that I, well, ooh, hello, I have, I have a river chocobo, uh, I have a mountain chocobo, I've, I've got a black one, I've got a gold chocobo? What the fuck? How's this motherfucker done this? Now, of course, I have had to use a guide for this. There is absolutely no way <laughs> that you're going to be able to, uh, that you're going to be able to get a gold chocobo without using a guide. So, I get that some people might be pissed, because this is, obviously, an almost entirely blind playthrough, but... Yeah, I mean, there's no way, <laughs> there's no way of doing this without a guide, so if you consider that blind playthrough ruined, then uh, I get it, but I want to experience, like, everything this game has to offer, because the more I've played it, the more I've really come to love it, so, you know, I, uh, I, I felt like it was something I wanted to do. Now, this, this didn't actually take that long. Uh, turns out there's, a, there's multiple methods to getting a gold chocobo. The first method is, uh... Like, you have to do a shitload of gold saucer racing and stuff. And, uh, you also need, like, tons of cash to level up the chocobos. So if we look in my menu, you'll see that I have a little bit of gill now, uh, that I didn't have before. And, uh, that is because the method to getting a ton of cash is to sell, uh, maxed out all materia. And, as luck would have it, I had four all materia that were, like, just a few battles off being maxed. Uh, so I sold those, I maxed them and sold them, and that got me a ton of cash, and then I also raised four, because when you max them, a material, it gives birth to a new one, uh, so I raised, uh, the new one back to level four, so that I wasn't, like, missing out on the effects, so I got it back to where I had it before, um, which also meant that during that time, we did get some levels, uh, I think we were, like, 50 before, and we're now at, like, 54, 55, 56, uh, so yeah, we got we got some levels. I did not test out any of the summons that we had got but not used in the last part. Uh, I think Tifa gained a new limit break. I haven't tested that out either. Uh, so I haven't seen anything new in that regards. Uh, and yeah, that was that was the plan, was to do it via the Chocobo Racing method, because I didn't know there was another method. But it turns out there's another much simpler method, <laughs> which I found out after doing all that, uh, which doesn't really require much cash at all. So, uh, then I didn't have to really spend the cash. <laughs> so, now I just have it. And I guess we're going to be buying whatever weapons we need in future. Uh, but the other method is, uh, people have just figured out how to, like, force RNG 
by doing like set numbers of battles in the open world before breeding the chocobos and by handing them a couple of specific items and stuff. And so this, once I started actually, once I caught the first chocobo, uh, it took about uh, one hour, I think, like 60 minutes to uh, go from one chocobo to gold chocobo just by doing some like really simple stuff that didn't take much time or money. So uh, that's cool that <laughs> people have figured out how to do that. Uh, but anyway, yes, so. Uh, how do I take them out? Do I speak? I speak to you, right? Uh, riding chocobos, yes. Which one are you gonna take? Uh, my great female? Nope. <laughs> my wonderful male? Nope. River female? Mountain male? Black female? And... My lovely Leffy. Why, yes, I will be riding... The Golden Chocobo. So. So, what can we do with this little bitch? Well, ain't that the question. Over here, a long time ago, do you remember? Do you remember? A long time ago. I think it was like as soon as we got the airship and I was looking for a new place to go with it. <laughs> uh, was this cave. And I was like, how the fuck did you get here? And uh, yeah, that, that's, that's how you get here. So... What have we got? What have we got? Over the course of many years, Marco energy crystallizes into materia. Received quadra magic. What the fuck is quadra magic? Uh... Paired magic used four times? Holy shit! Does it cost four times as much to use? <laughs> and the trade-off is that you're getting it all done in one turn? Or does it still cost the same amount to use, but you're quadrupling the damage for free? I assume, because it's a blue one, I assume like all, you can only use it a single time until you level it up, and then two stars you could use it twice, and stuff like that. But that could go absolutely insane. Okay, uh... Man, that sounds incredible. <laughs> what do I want to use that on? Oh yeah, and of course, I also was able to get a whole bunch more like HP and stuff because as I was leveling my new all materia, it also meant that my other stuff was of course getting leveled. So we have like MP plus and HP plus up to like three and four stars. Uh, so that's gonna be helpful. Uh, what do I want to use Quadra Magic on? I have no idea. Who would even be best placed? What is... What are people's stats? You have magic... Wait, you have magic 99? Really? You have magic 108? Okay. And you have magic 131. Okay, so Barrett would want to use it more than anyone. Uh... What could I give Barrett... It's like, it's not like he wants to use it on Barrier or Restore. Uh, does it work? It did say magic, didn't it? Does it work on, like, summons? <laughs> Could you Quadra summon? Which was, which was the new Bahamut? We've got Bahamut Zero. And we've got Neo Bahamut. Neo Bahamut I've got at two stars, so it must be Bahamut Zero that is the new one, right? That I haven't seen yet. Uh... Hmm, hum 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 hum. Oh yeah, we also got Ultima to uh, level two, which means we can actually use it now. Have not done so yet. Again, wanted to save all that for actually seeing it for the first time whilst recording was occurring, so uh, that'll be fun. Um, maybe Ramu can go. We have got Ramu up to three stars, but it's been a while since we got Ramu, so it might be time to say goodbye to old Ramu. Hmm. 
I'm thinking that's probably the call. If we swap Hades down to here, and then we get rid of Ramu. And we Quadra Magic Ultima. That could be fun, right? <laughs> that could be fun. Sure, why not? Let's try that. Let's try that. Cool. Okay. Yoink. Now, uh, apparently... There is stuff to go see up north on the map that's not actually marked on the map. That is where the uh, the famed most powerful magic resides, is like way up north, I believe. Uh, but yeah, apparently it's not actually marked on the map. So, let us... Uh, I don't know why I'm, I'm like going around landmass, even though I can just walk straight over it now. Boo, 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 doo, boo doo. Okay, so somewhere up here. Somewhere up here should be the good shit, apparently. Oh yeah, I can three times speed. That'd help. Uh, this is the north. This is the top of the map. Uh, have I missed it? Oh! Today I learned you can go out the bottom of the map to come out the top? Huh. Didn't know that was a thing. I was told it is like just right at the top of the map. Am I being blind? <laughs> or have I been trolled? Oh! Aha! Is this it? Top right hand corner? What the fuck, Cloud? What are you doing? Is this a forest? Bom 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 bom. Over the course of many years, Marco energy crystallizes into materia. Received Knights of the Round materia. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh man, I don't know. <laughs> I've gotta. I'm gonna have to get rid of some stuff. I am gonna have to get rid of some stuff. I am getting too much materia. <laughs> um. Kujata is very cool, but often not super useful. Did I, I got Ku, did I get Kujata before Bahamut? I can't remember which of these is more powerful. I guess if I just go into Cloud's material without going into a range, I can see which has. Oh, they both have incredibly similar AP. They are literally just 50 AP difference, which is like a single fight. Huh. I guess I got them at the same time then. Although apparently it's way easier to level up Bahamut than it is to level up Kujata. They have the same amount of AP, but Bahamut is closer to the next level. By an order of 10,000. Huh. Um... Yeah, do I get rid of... Because Kujata deals, like, a ton of different elements worth of damage, which is great, unless they absorb one of those things, which bosses often do, and you only really need to use summons on bosses. And then the boss is just like, I think I'll heal off your attack instead. So maybe it's time to get rid of that. It's been fun, Kujata. Adios, my guy. Knights of the Round. Magic plus 8, magic defense plus 8, max HP minus 10%. It's probably a good thing I've got this fucking uh, HP plus somewhere here. Max HP up 30, so <laughs> max HP down 10 is not, not that big of a deal. Because that is, I think that's the biggest stat change we've actually seen from the addition of a materia. 
Alright, cool, sick. Bom, 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 bom. So, where else? Um, that one fucking cave that we've seen for so long near the gold saucer. I believe that is... We needed a river chocobo to get into that, but obviously gold can just do whatever. Bum, ba dum ba dum ba dum ba dum bum bum So, whereabouts was it? It was like over here, right? Three times speed, go! Uh, it's Costa del Sol. Uh, here! Right, what is this? Over the course of many years, Marco Energy crystallizes into materia. HP Arrow MP? What? Exchange HP and MP levels. Why the fuck would I ever want to do that? <laughs> Like, my MP, I don't think I have a single character with MP higher than, like, a thousand, right? I'm pretty sure, like, 860 is my max, which would mean my max HP would be under a thousand, which means I would get one shot by, like, every boss. Hmm. I'm sure there's a use for that somewhere, but I can't think of it. So I ain't gonna equip it. <laughs> That's the weird one. That is not one that makes me go, hell yeah. What was this place? Oh, this is <laughs> this is Rocket Town without the rocket, right. <laughs> I was looking at this like, I don't fucking remember this thing. But it's because the rocket's gone. Okay, and then I think there was one more thing that people said to get, which was somewhere on Wutai? Apparently there is a cave somewhere on Wutai area that uh, is attainable with Choco Buddy here. Uh, this is dead end, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, whoa! <laughs> Can't see. Oh, there it is. Hello, can I get off? Game? May I, may I dis- there we go. <laughs> the game was like, no, you're staying on this fucking chocobo. Over the course of many years, Marco Energy will crystallize into materia. Received mime materia. Mr. Mime? Equips Mime Command. Right. I have no idea what that is. <laughs> uh, cool, I guess. What would Mime be? M to mime something? To mimic something? Maybe it's to do with, like, enemy skill? Like you're mimicking an en enemy's attack or something? Like enemy skill you... Well, enemy skill you keep it. You get hit by it, and if you survive, you keep it, right? Hmm. Uh, I guess we can try it. But boy, do I have no idea what to replace at this point. <laughs> I definitely want to keep, like, counterattack and cover on Cloud. I would like to keep the pluses on everyone. How does Barrett have the lowest MP? Cloud, do you have you have a four star MP plus? Let's swap Cloud's MP plus with Barrett's MP plus. Because Barrett needs the MP capacity more, I think. 
Although that being said, if this is like the ultimate, <laughs> if this is like the ultimate fucking materia, then maybe that's gonna cost a shitload of MP. Potentially. Potentially. I guess we'll find out. Uh, so how much, how much do you have after taking that off? Weren't you at like 860 or something? So, changing that two, four star to a two star is like a hundred MP difference. That's pretty crazy. That's pretty crazy. Um, okay, yeah, so who actually wants mine materia? I don't know. Uh... Man, there's just so much shit that I want at this point. <laughs> mm, I mean, is Odin gonna have to go? It's been a long time since we got Odin. Maybe Odin's not worth it anymore. We'll see what it does. If the answer is just copies whatever the enemy does, then I'll probably put Odin back on. Alright, there we go. I believe that is everywhere that people said to check. So we have a bunch of cool new materia, so that's pretty cool. Uh, so... The other place is that raised one that we found near Cosmo Canyon. Uh, now where the fuck is Cosmo Canyon again? Is it like over here or something? Oh yeah. And then the raised bit is right here. Okay, what are you? Hello. Release insects and frogs by pressing A. Insects and frogs react differently depending on where you release them, so try many different places. Right. I guess you're the insect. Oh, you can only carry one, I guess? Okay, I guess I have an insect now. Yeah, you can only carry one thing. Oh, you can be random battled here, I see. <laughs> For some reason, I thought the enemy was dead. <laughs> uh, okay, I guess over here then? Oh, I see. <laughs> uh, did that really hurt? I think that really hurt. Can I like sneak in and get this? Okay, no. Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck, but wait, I dropped the little jumpy boy. Okay. Um... What is background element? And what isn't? Oh my god, I just saw my health. That went down quite significantly.
What if I put the frog on the Venus flytrap? Does it eat the frog instead of me? Wait, what? Received super shot ST. Oh, what? That let me pick it up that time? Huh. What is super shot ST? Keep scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. Yeah. I passed it. Oh, there it is. It is a Vincent weapon, is that? I. Am I ever going to use Vincent at this point? Probably not. I feel like I'm pretty set with my party at the moment. God damn it. <laughs> I really want to... There's got to be a way... Does the frog really not trigger this motherfucker? I guess not. And random battle! And random battle! Oh! Oh! Okay, that makes this go down, but then I can't... Are missing so much. What the fuck? Oh. Okay, that spits it out. Okay, so. Do I need to, like... Motherfucker. Bro. How many misses? <laughs> that thing's, uh, dodge rate is wild. Wait, where did it spit out? Wait. Where did it spit out the little things? Did it just eat them? <laughs> uh, it spat the frog back out up here, but the little things are nowhere to be seen now? So, how do I get across? I am confused! I can't do anything... It doesn't let... It kicks you off. Hmm. Okay, this... <laughs> this puzzle place... Is confusing. Dude, this thing's dodge rate is insane. It has to be something to do with this, then? You gonna eat this, motherfucker? Hmm... Run! Running does not work.
If I can't, I would have thought the frog would be able to trigger this, but it doesn't seem like it can, which means it has to be something to do with the three things at the top. But if it's something to do with the three things at the top, then I need the three little bugs. But the three little bugs got eaten and have not returned. Oh, hey. So, do I need to, like, go out to reset them, maybe? That has reset the three little bugs. Press X to give up. Right. Okay, so what if I put all three little bugs down here? Taking some damage. What if I put the three little bugs up here so I can, like, quickly run and get the next one? Because I need to jump across before it spits it back out, as far as I can tell. So we go bonk, bonk. Wait, did it not pick it up? Oh, you motherfucker. I thought I heard the noise. Oh, there we go. What? Wait, it didn't pick it up again? Oh, come on. I swear I heard the noise to say it picked it up. That's some bullshit. That is what you do. I'm pretty sure. But, brother. That's some bullshit. Okay, round three. I swear I heard that noise to say it had picked it up. I fucking swear. Alright, here we go. One. Two. Okay, we definitely got it that time. Three. Nice. Okay, we're across. Hallelujah. Now what? Got two frogs. I've got a frog on me. Oh. Okay, that just happened when I walked right. I hate these things. Go, go, gadget. Barrett. I can't believe it missed. I can't believe it missed. <laughs> okay, what have we got here? Received spring gun clip. Is that a Barrett weapon? We just got a Vincent weapon. Uh, no, it's not. Wait, what was that? Oh, initial. Uh, okay, what was it then? Spring gun clip. Uh, oh! A red weapon. Huh. I kind of do want to use red, but I just... I don't know. Like, I love these characters more than any of the others, I guess, because we've known them for the longest, and obviously from Remake as well, I've known them the longest in there. So, I don't know. Jump or stay? What does is, what is jumping do? Jumping puts me here. Okay. Oh, there's materia down there. How the fuck do I get that without activating the trap? You've 
activated my trap card. Uh... Hmm. Okay, I probably need to trigger it with a frog or a fucking cricket, I guess. Is this a cave I can go in? What the fuck? Bruh. <laughs> what is that noise? Can I go in here? I don't think so. Well, I just need... That one's already down, so... If I just do that, I can jump across. But that doesn't explain how to get... That. What is that up top? Have I got, like, added effect frog on or something? I don't understand how that guy got turned into a frog. How did that happen? Where's my added effect? Oh! Added effect Hades on the weapon. It turns them into a frog sometimes? Oh, that's kind of sick! Right, because I had- I swapped it, didn't I? wonder what added effect Knights of the Round does. I mean, that's kind of cool. I'll take that. I'll keep- I'll keep that on. Uh, right. I have absolutely no fucking clue how I'm supposed to get this material. <laughs> um, oh, hello. Oh, it's like behind the screen, I think. Uh, I can do that, but then I can't, like, yeet over there. Unless, is it gonna spit me out? Ah! Okay. God damn it! <laughs> what is that? I don't know what that is. I tried to pick it up and I jumped off. It's like an fucking acorn or something? With flies around it? Does the acorn with flies interact with this at all? God damn it. I didn't mean to walk into it. Oh! Received slash all material. The acorn with flies do be interacting with it. What the fuck is slash all? Man, we are getting materia out the arse today. Attack all opponents? It's an AoE materia? 130 to next level and you get flash? Cloud whips his cock out and all the enemies run away in fear of the majestic 12 inch dong. Is that what I'm seeing? Man, an AoE materia. So like, double cut is like doubling down on single target, and then slash is for big AoE situations, I guess. That is very cool. However, can you double cut and slash? Oh my god, I just realized that double cut turns into four times cut eventually as well. Oh man. Hang on, hang on. God, I just don't have, I just don't have the materia slots, man. I just don't have the materia slots. Okay, you know what, Cloud doesn't need, oh wait, no, Cloud doesn't have magic plus. <laughs> I, was gonna, I was gonna be like, okay, Cloud can get rid of magic plus. He doesn't have it. <laughs> he has MP plus and HP plus. These are cover encounter. Fuck. I guess he doesn't need elemental. We're not using that at the moment. 
So let's swap MP plus. Let's put MP plus up there. And then let's put slash all here. And does he... Let's find out if he double slashes all opponents. Well, it might be actually hard to tell here because most of the opponents are ones that we miss all the time. But still, we'll see. We shall see. Uh, okay. Hang on, so... Oh, right, I haven't... Okay. I just saw mime in the, uh, in the action list and forgot I haven't tried that yet. So, is this how we get over here as well? Does it just yeet me over this massive trap? Alright. How do we get this thing up in the tree? Unsure how we get this thing up in the tree. Maybe we come back later? Hmm. I don't think there's anything we can do with that now. Let's move on. 